Okay, hello Scorpions. How you doing? This is Keeping It Classy. I'm doing Romance of a Lifetime. How they feel about you guys. Reading for you guys. Please hit the notification button below to be notified when I post a video. Like, share the video. Hit the join button to become a member of my channel. Thank you much. Subscribe, new viewers. Subscribe to my channel. Thank you for stopping by and checking me out, okay? You guys, I will be doing random readings, and I'll let you know the date that I'm going to start doing the random readings, okay? And I'll give you my email address to send an email of your information to get the random readings. They will be free readings. And when I end the random readings, I will begin doing um, charging for readings. So, if you like how I do my readings, then um, you can continue to get readings from me, okay? All right. So, let's get started. You guys sit back and enjoy this romance of a lifetime. How they feel about you guys, read. Okay, romance of a lifetime on how they feel about Scorpios. Romance of a lifetime on how they feel about Scorpios. Romance of a Lifetime on how they feel about Scorpios. Okay. Okay. So somebody wants to charge for it in a success with you, Scorpio. This is a Cancer chariot. They may even be wanting to visit you, travel with you. Um, five of Swords, but they're feeling a little defeat. On being able to do this for some reason. Eight of Cups. Okay, they may be thinking about walking away from the situation because they're 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 going through such a hard time on moving forward and the success with you. The page of wands. This person may um announce this to you, how they're feeling. Or they may announce to you that they're walking away from the situation altogether. But the Nine of Swords, but they're still mentally stuck on you. I mean, they stay up at night worrying about you. They be up all night worrying about you. Okay, so let's get some more insight. Um... Romance of a Lifetime on how they feel about Scorpio. Romance of a Lifetime on how they feel about Scorpio. Romance of a Lifetime on how they feel about Scorpio. So let's see. Okay, the Queen of Cups. Yeah, they're, they're really emotional at this time when it comes to you. They're on a lot of emotions for you, Scorpio. This is you. Okay, four pinnacles. And they're holding on to you. This person is wanting stability with you. They're holding on to you. And they watch you from afar. Look at that. Because they want this stability with you. Or they're stingy. They don't want anybody else to have you. Okay. You could have stability with this person. You could live with this person. Or they may give you stability to hold on to you. That's why they watch you. Because they they, they um, take care of you in some fashion, form, or manner. They may give you money. You know, they may pay your bills or something like that. So, you know, they, they, they watch you afar. They, they're stingy when it comes to you. They don't want nobody else to have you. Okay? The Ten of Cups. You make this person happy. They want the family cat, dog. They want everything with you. You make this person happy. You're this person's fulfillment. Okay, the Queen of Wands. Sagittarius energy. It could be Aries or Scorpio. Oh, this is Aries. Yeah, this is Aries. Aries, but it could be Sag or, or Leo. Yeah, you innerly satisfy this person. They hold a lot of passion for you. Look at them looking all lazy. They don't do nothing but sit around and think about you. Okay, 
Okay, the nine of cups. Look at them holding on to you. I don't want nobody else to have you. Nine of cups. Mm -hmm. Okay, um, romance of a lifetime on how they feel about Scorpio. Hey, let's see here. Yeah, they just, like I said, sit and they think about you. They don't want nobody else to have you. Wishful thinking when it comes to you. Hmm, an ending. This person may be going through a rebirth. Or they may feel bad that things end between you and them. The Queen of Wands. You may have been this person's mistress. For some of you, that's not all of you. You could have been this person. Somebody could have been this person's mistress and they had to end things with you for some reason. But they see you as seductive, you know, beautiful, secure within yourself, stable. Look at that. See his hat? That's why I said somebody may have been the mistress. The hat is on the ground. You know, roses on the floor. You guys probably tear it up when they pop over to your house. Okay, this person is manifesting you. And some of you guys, they're just, they, they may want stability with you. They're trying to manifest this stability with you. Okay, Emperor. They're doing a, a lot of inner reflecting on you guys' past. About maybe getting you back in their life, moving forward in the stability, you know, getting the stability with you, how they can go about getting you. <sighs> yeah, they're trying, they're thinking about inner reflecting on should they revive this or not? You know, should they bring this back to life between you and them? Because they're with someone that they're bored with, that they don't have any passion for. And they're wanting to move forward with you. They're in a reflecting on, um, did they move forward with you or not? Okay, so let's see. Yeah. Yep, there was someone that they they don't have any interest in. All right, romance, romance of a lifetime on how they feel about Scorpio. Romance of a lifetime on how they feel about Scorpio. Okay. Yep. They, they may, if they're married to this person, they, they, they may be thinking about getting a separation or divorce from this person so they could charge for it and success with you. 
Seven of Wands. They've been trying to fight you off. Or they've been trying to fight, you know. Yeah, they've been trying to fight the desire that they may have for you. But they no longer can stay away from you. They may be trying to fight you off, but they can't no longer. Okay. Now they're wanting the wheel to turn in their favor when it comes to you. They've been trying to fight you off, but they can't fight you off anymore any longer. They want to come into union with you. Okay. They want the wheel to turn in their favor when it comes to you. Maybe they feel like they're being divinely guided towards you. Yep. They're trying to gain insight. Okay, on the situation. On um, which way to go in this situation. They're trying to gain some insight. Maybe they feel you balanced them out as well. Okay. Their patience has ran out. You know, as well. Their patience is running out <laughs> when it comes to you. Okay. They have a lot of other people that want them, want their time, attentions, but they only want to give this to you. They want to, you know, bear gifts to you as well. Their focus is on you. They got people behind them fighting over them. Or they may be, it could be like um, their family, you know. It could be family as well back there. They're ignoring them. They may not want, the family may not want them with you, but they want to be with you. They don't care what nobody says. The page of cups. Okay, so you may be hearing some good news from this person. This person may surprise you. They may message you and tell you this, that they can't stay away from you. They want to be with you. So you may hear some good news from this person if this is somebody that you want to be with. Water sign. This is water, water, earth, um, fire. For some of you, it's, you know, they either have all that in their chart or some of you, it's, it's a water sign. For some of you, it's a air, earth, and fire. Okay, let me get a few more cards. Romance of a lifetime on how they feel about Scorpio. Romance of a lifetime on how they feel about Scorpio. Yeah, they hold a lot of passion for you. They want to passionate new beginning with you and they're going to message you this look they're going to message you this and tell you they want this passionate new beginning for you either a message phone call or face to face five of cups they regret ending things with you you know and they probably ended things with you because of their other person they didn't want any confusion you know look at that so this might happen, you know, it might be some confusion, it might be exposed, and some, ex you know, yep, they're ready, the Knight of Wands, they're ready to move forward, and the, they're coming, if they're at a distance from you, they're traveling towards you, or they're going to heal this emotional distance that's between you and them, that they caused by ending things with you. Or they may want to move in with you. They may tell you they want to move in with you. They're ready. Okay. All right. So, wow. Okay, Scorpio. So, now, um, let's get some more insight. Okay. Romance of a lifetime on how they feel and what they want with Scorpio. Romance of a lifetime on how they feel and what they want with Scorpio. Romance of a lifetime on how they feel and what they want with Scorpio. Okay, so let's get this. Okay, sudden wealth. Hmm. So this person may see you as sudden wealth, or you guys may be getting some sudden wealth, or this person may come into some sudden wealth or has sudden wealth, or maybe if they're going through issues with their partner and they're bored with their partner and they leave their partner, sudden wealth. You know, you'll be an income. So look out for that. Be careful. Judication, yeah. Because they may be going through a divorce when they go through this separation. 
you know they know they're gonna lose some income so you guys be careful don't let anybody use you guys but they're doing a lot of inner reflecting on whether or not um to get this separation so they can move forward with you okay so they think about you and what they need to do to be with you toil and labor they know this is going to be a um long you know this is going to take a while before them for them to do this and it's going to be hard it's not going to be something easy okay it's not going to be easy for them to get this um separation and it's going to take some time okay all right and they may be worried because they don't want to have to um, work hard they know if they lose some finances they have to they may have to work hard they may be worried about that they may have to get two or three jobs you know because they know they have to take care of you too all right so um Romance, these are love messages. So we're going to see what love messages are here for you guys or advice. Romance of a lifetime on how they feel about Scorpio. Romance of a lifetime on how they feel about Scorpio. Okay. So balance. Love is not always about agreeing just for the sake of it. A great relationship is one that both supports and challenges. Okay. Emotions are natural and necessary part of life, but they can also distort your perception and cloud your vision. In order to see things clearly, you must let go of resentment. When you pass from this world, you take nothing with you but your soul and the memories you have shared with those you love. Give thanks for the blessings of love soon to come your way. Know that you deserve to be and have all that your heart truly desires. All right. Okay, Scorpio, that's the end of your um, romance of a lifetime story read. I hope, you know, I could give you guys some insight on something you need to hear or wanted to hear to help you move forward in a situation. All right. Or get some closure on a situation. All right. Okay, you guys, hit that notification button below to be notified when I post a video. Hit the join button to become a member of my channel. Like, share this video, and subscribe to my channel. You guys, I'd love to have you as a subscriber. And I thank all the new subscribers that have subscribed to my channel. I thank you guys and really appreciate it. And even all my subscribers that I have, I thank you guys for being my subscriber. I really appreciate it. All right, thank you for going on this journey with me. All right. Love you guys. And again, be on the lookout for um, me sending the message out about when I'm going to do random readings.